Hi, my name is Siren Rico and uh, I am a PhD student major in environmental and analytical chemistry under the mentorship of Dr. Jorge Gadea from the University of Texas at El Paso and uh, I am originally from the Philippines but before joining the lab of Dr. Gadea I was, I was a researcher in Korea. Basically, we are looking at the interaction of nanoparticles or engineered nanomaterials with plants, especially the food crops. And we are interested in seeing if these nanomaterials go into the plants, and if they do, do they go to the food chain and transfer to the trophic levels. And my project is on the impacts of cerium oxide nanoparticles or nanoceria on different cereals like rice, wheat, and barley. We are getting some very good and interesting results. For example, we use spectrum microscopy and linear combination techniques and we found that the exposure to nanoceria affect the physiological activity and even the biochemical composition of these plants. And when we did further studies, long-term studies, we found that the cerium go, goes to the, to the grains of rice and barley and they accumulate in these grains heavily but not so much in wheat. But when we look at the growth and yield production or the grain production, we found that rice was not so much affected. Wheat was a little bit affected, but it was detrimental to, to barley production. Our finding shows the implications of nanomaterials or nanoceria on the food quality and even the human health and nutrition, and even possibly the grain production of this of these grains and if these nanomaterials go to the grains and we consume these grains because rice and wheat they are consumed worldwide they may end up in our body I guess that would be my love for plants and I like to apply analytical chemistry analytical te techniques on studying plants and when I was in Korea, I did masters there and worked with plants. And when I was looking for a PhD position, I found the lab of Dr. Gaidei, I found his uh, publications, and next thing I know, I'm here in the U.S. and I'm with the UCCI, and that's great! Mm, challenge! Because every day you go to the lab, you go to work in the lab, but sometimes you get very frustrating results, so you have to be creative. You have to find ways find solutions on how to overcome these problems and once you get the good results you will be very happy it's very very like wow I get something new and you become a better person you gain more knowledge